This is how the so-called loudness war is damaging the sound quality of modern CDs. First, I'll play an example of a track from 1989. Notice the clarity and punch of the drums. Since the two drum hits are already maximum volume, if we want the track louder on the recording, we have to take the quieter bits and turn them up. If this track had been released in 2006, someone would probably have insisted that it be this loud. Now it sounds much louder, and in the short term, louder can seem better. But you own the volume knob, not the record producer. So you adjust your volume to find your preferred level. Here we have the same volume as the original. Unfortunately, the loudness treatment permanently changes the sound. Do you notice what's missing? The red sections mark where the punch and clarity would have been. Let's hear what that maximized track sounds like at regular listening volume. Wimpy loud sound. All the punch of the drums is gone, along with much of the feel of the music that comes from some parts being louder than others. When there's no quiet, there can be no loud. The original makes you turn up your volume, and when you do, it sounds great. Mm -hmm. 